Hello, hello. It's London Electricity here. Um, I'm going to walk you through the Rebuilding Better Worlds album, which I've been teasing you with, but here it is in all its glory. We're going to kick off with the Hugh Hardy remix of Build a Better World. Now, Hugh vibes this. He vibed it. Check it out. Yes, Hugh, I am so grateful for this remix. Thank you so much for turning this in. I love it absolutely to bits. Okay, let's, let's go, what's next? Okay, I've been teasing you like crazy with this. And this remix is by Cleeks. We don't even know who cliques are, but I managed to get out of them that they're from Brighton. I don't even know if it's one person or several, but they really pulled this out of the bag because it's almost like a live recreation in, in many ways. So yeah, uh, cliques who have got their new EP out this Friday, I do believe. Go and get it, it's good. Right, next up. The dulcet tones of the Secretary General when he was nine years old. Now, a lot of you guessed this remix right. It's by Think Tom. Watch out to Dan Think Tom. Come on. Breathe again. Breathe again. Back to the stop. Breathe again. Breathe again. Think Tong is really coming through big time. He is razor sharp. He's totally got his own sound. He's just got that proper kind of like, oh, 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 oh. And he does it better than anyone else. Amazing. Breathe again. I've got to go through these quite quickly because there's quite a few of them, but 
uh, yeah, subscribe to the um, the pre-order or the pre-save or whatever it is, and you'll get it soon, ish. Okay. Uh, oh yeah, there's vinyl as well. Check it out. Right. What's next? I know what's next. This is amazing. Right. Final view from the rooftops. The first tune on Building Better Worlds. Arguably one of the most kind of out there and involved drum and bass tracks ever. And there was only one person I could think of to remix this. And that was Justin Hawkes. He used to go by the name of Flight. Um, and Justin has got the musical scope and imagination to to really kind of work a tune like this. It's not easy. Um, I'm actually going to play it from the beginning through to about halfway through the first drop because it's so it's so good and so much happens. Check it out. Sydney B on vocals. much for this. Thank you for that wonky drop. It is sick. the original composition more than justice i am a very lucky man having my tunes remixed by all these amazing amazing producers right what's next up oh, this is sick lonely sirens and uh it's my fair hand on the remix. Big shout to Elsa Esmeralda on vocals here. For writing the lyrics. Yes, Elsa. Check out her solo work. It is awesome. She's got to release that right now.
Now this remix is a game of two halves, Michael. Uh, check the second half, because it goes kind of like into jazz funk jungle territory. Check it out. One person guessed this actually. Um, this is Funkopolis remixed by Mosey. Check it. Mosinator. Beautiful, funky, warm, hard hitting. Right, what's next? Okay, uh, managed to get these up without any titles, so it's nice. guessed this correctly it's uh winslow on the remix check the bass drum she slowly caught fire featuring bulgarian goddess massive shout out to daniela big pleasure to meet duncan winslow at hospitality for the hospital records from the US of A. Uh, yeah, things are definitely moving forwards. What's next? I'm trying to guess it from the waveform. Stop a minute. I wish you could see it too. This this was originally a collaboration between me and Urban Dawn. Um, 
I first gave it to Danielle Flavor D to remix, and she turned in a sketch that was actually very, very promising. But then she got kind of overtaken with other work and she was in lockdown in America and stuff like that and it never actually got finished. And I didn't think I was going to get a remix of this tune, but a week before the deadline, I heard a tune by Lilac, who is a very, very talented, um, quite deep producer. So I hit her up and I said, look, I need a remix in about three days. What do you reckon? You've got the weekend. And she was like, oh yeah, brilliant. Send the part. So I sent her the stems and she sent this back. It's awesome. Like really, really special. Check it out. Kubrick's View, which, if you know anything about Stanley Kubrick, was originally kind of inspired by it was some of the photos by Ben Westbeach who did all the kind of like decaying Japanese architecture photos on the original album. And I noticed that some of them had this perspective that reminded me of Stanley Kubrick, who used to do this amazing symmetrical long shot perspective kind of thing. And um, so this tune was a sketch, and I thought, yeah, that's a really nice title for the tune. Um, I didn't know who to remix it, but I wanted Degs to do a remix because Degs and his brother are brilliant in the studio, making beats, making music. So I said to Degs, will you do it? And he started it, the sketch was lovely, and then he said, can I put a vocal on it? So I was like, yeah, yeah, of course. And this is what we've got, and it's a lovely kind of cocktail sort of, lounge corey kind of natural funk soul thing check it shout to dex shackles off blast off no longer bound by an enemy no longer tied to the great unseen but more connected than i've ever been five words i just let shit Moving through as I fly like a bird or a plane or anything Imagination's the vessel taking us all to the moon I don't need no religion to smile when the sky is so blue
excellent. Thank you for hosting my set on uh, on Saturday, Hospitality in the Woods. Um, I was in the most pain. I was on crutches. I kind of staggered onto the stage and the music carried me through and Dex carried me through and you you guys who were there, you carried me through as well. So thank you for all of that. I managed to get through it and played a half decent set, so that's good. Right, what's next? Never trust a hippie. And there was only one producer that, well, actually, I was gonna ask Woody, but he was busy with his album. Not that, not that you're second best logistics, you're not. You're in a sphere of your own. The logistics remix of Never Trust a Hippie. moves there from logistics love it beautiful rendition of never trust a hippie and why should you never trust a hippie well the thing is hippies tend to end up being entrepreneurs and uh, businessmen and they end up being the kind of sharkiest um, the the most unscrupulous people in business that I've ever met in my life right What's next? Possible worlds. Now, none of you got this when I put the tease up. It's by the one and only Digital Native. A beautiful piece of work indeed. this one. about my dad who had died sort of reasonably recently before that I wrote this and I couldn't finish it so I got whiny in and it ended up being a collaboration with the amazing Will Whiny and this is his VIP check it
Now this is a study in bass, it's a study in vocal manipulation because he's used all the original vocal hits, completely changed them, transformed them. And it's a, it's a beautifully understated, but very complex uh, and hard hitting piece of work. Thank you, Will Winey, who is on fire at the moment on his own music and also co-producing people. Right, check this. Okay, Don't Give Up Now, featuring Bulgarian Goddess. A song I wrote in 1990, 1990 actually. Before most of you were born. If you are a budding producer yourself, you could do a lot worse than to sign up to one of Villem's production masterclasses. Okay, uh, we have two more remixes to go. And in some ways we've saved the best till last. So see if you can guess what this is. Okay, if you play Forza, you will recognize this. Now that's a switch. There was only one person I could ask to remix this, and that was Vlad Polaris. Who has done this more than justice. An amazing remix. Big shout out to Vlad. Hope you're okay, mate. builds the composition, uh, fantastic chord changes, great interpretation on the piano and an all round lovely remix. Thank you, Vlad. I'm very, very grateful. And uh, the final remix, what I mentioned earlier, very, very special. This is Funkopolis remix by Seba. Sebastian, thank you for this. I absolutely love it. Check it out.
Seb was making this remix, he was also building a house in Sweden. And he was sending me pictures of this, like the frame of the house that he constructed. I think he's finished it now. So that's a first for me. I've never had a, a remix from a producer. He's simultaneously building a house as he's building a remix. Well done. Uh, it's more than half an hour. But that's the remixes on Rebuilding Better Worlds. It's available for pre-order or pre-save right now. It's coming out on Hospital Records. It's coming out sometime towards the end of October. I haven't actually checked the release date. Doesn't really matter. But um, link in bio, etc. Enjoy. I really hope you enjoy it as much as I've enjoyed like just listening to these remixes coming in. It's been very special for me. Okay, peace out. I'm London Electricity. Thank you.